back to V Vlogs. We are currently on our way to Walmart because we have to do a 2024 edition of finding the strangest, creepiest, weirdest toy. If you've been here for a while, we've been doing this for a handful of years and we always feel so awkward going into these stores, <laughs> going through the toy sections, trying to find the weirdest toy, but we have succeeded every time. And if you've seen our Toys R Us video, we found a purse with eyes that talks and blinks. And I think that was our most successful find yet. Okay, I don't know if anything's gonna top that talking, blinking purse, but we're gonna see, you never know. I would say talking is a bit of a stretch. It's more like just sound effects <laughs> and like gibberish at most. It was so creepy. It's more like exclamations. I think it'd be terrifying <sighs> if it actually spoke words at you. Cause yeah. that thing would just go off randomly. But it did say it had like 500 phrases or something, not 500, but a lot. Sure, like 30. And we didn't go through <laughs> them all. So it might've spoke. Anyways though, we're gonna head into Walmart. We're gonna walk around. We're gonna try and find something creepy. And I thought that it would also be cool if for members only, we find a second item and unbox it on the members only channel. So if you would like to become a member, you just have to subscribe down below and uh, yeah. Let's go to Walmart. Okay, we found Stitch Puppets. Real effects Disney Stitch Puppet. How do I do it? I, I would think you have to buy it before you can do it, Jess. I want to do it. Okay, but it's kind of cute though. But I am a little bit scared. It's all the fun of puppeteering without the terrifying aspect of being a ventriloquist. <laughs> because it speaks for you. It's great. We're in Walmart, might as well get stuff we actually need. There's Ooh. always something scary about a peekaboo doll. <gasps> And this doesn't scare babies. No, it just causes them to develop like attention deficit disorders when they're older. <laughs> it's terrifying. Just quick, what would win? Choose, which one wins? That one wins, the T-Rex always wins. Why does it win though? Because it, it's better. Why is it better? It's scarier. But that one has frills though. I don't feel as weird about being in this aisle anymore because we have a niece. So we could do this creepy video and look for a toy for her. Two birds in one stone. My vote's for that little guy right there. <laughs> that guy in there wins. Yeah. Two birds in one stone, Jess? Is that not the saying? No. I wanna get all of these Harry Potter Legos. Look, it's Buckbeak. Two birds and one stone. Honey, that's just an observation, not a saying. <laughs> What's the saying? Spiders. We should get one. Look, the castle. The saying is much more dark than you think. Oh, but that's right though. No. What is it? Tell me. Well, it's really only part of the castle. You should be more excited about this. I'm disappointed in your um, expression of this. Two birds with <gasps> one stone. Because you're hurting them? Yeah. I'm sorry, Jess. Um, you're the one that had me buy all the Lego Harry Potter games and Lego Pirates of the Caribbean games. Okay, scratch that. I don't like that saying anymore. Scratch it. And Lego Lord of the Rings games and Lego Hobbit games. We'll play them. I'm surprised you haven't made me get the Lego Star Wars games yet. <gasps> Let's get them. Hold on a second, that's not okay. I know. That is not okay. I was just thinking <gasps> about that. You're teaching kids how to make a mini martini? Wait, I think we should get one just to see what this is about. I don't like this. I come to life, Threddy Bear. What does he do when he comes to life? <gasps> make a wish? Wait. Magic button eyes. Are you kidding me? Happy hour for children? Make it a mini happy hour? What? Okay, I'm getting this because I am baffled. You gotta get a mother, yeah. This is not okay. <laughs> what? Oh, and she's sleeping beside it and it's talking to her. It's a cat stuffed in a jar. We are in the creepiest uh, toy aisle right now. <laughs> All eyes on us, literally. A cat stuffed in a jar, Jess. <laughs> it doesn't even fit. Isn't this the viral thing where people are making her bald? Oh no, did they fix it? See, these are one of the toys that I had growing up, but they were not this small. When I was a kid, you needed like four hands That's to use That's crazy, like look at my hand beside it. How are you supposed to play with this? It's shrinkflation. The nostalgia's real. Like I want to get one of these so badly, but they'll probably die. Yeah. I'll have you know that just 
well, that one's dead now. <laughs> all of us, we grew up with one of those things. And then just one day, we all just decided to stop. That's so sad. So it's just sitting there waiting Aww. until its battery fizzled out. Now it's just sitting in a constant state of limbo, neither alive nor dead, just existing in pure darkness. That's awful. Yeah, I named mine Steve. So <laughs> Steve's just gone now. <laughs> Are you having fun? <laughs> That's it? Yes, can I tell you the story of how my friends got banned from Walmart for like six months? I have the idea. Yeah. Do you truly think this is probably the scariest of all? Nurturing a crippling cardboard addiction. You want to reenact it? No. <laughs> this is me when I run away now. <laughs> all right, back in the car. So I'll show you what we got. But firstly, we were planning on, like I said, finding another creepy item for the member only video. But because we found what we would call a disturbing item that we still can't wrap our head around, we're actually gonna do the weird kids toy that we found for our member only video because I just need to know what is in this. Is it like beer cans? I'm just so confused why this is available for kids. So on the member video, we're gonna unbox this and really see what we have going on here. Like, should parents be complaining about this? It's so disturbing. It is a little bit, but we'll go more into it when we unbox it. Members only video. There's probably a little thing popping up around, around here. <laughs> Being the editor, I usually know where these things pop up, but uh, yeah, if you guys want to see that, join the club. We parked in a very bad spot for sunlight. Very bad. We're such good vloggers. Okay, are we gonna show the other two items or should we wait till we get home? Let's wait until we get home. All right, because we got two creepy items. Well, this head massager sucks. what I got. It is a teddy bear with button eyes, which is totally on brand. We love Coraline, we love Jessaline, we love button eyes. Except, do we love what this does? Because I was not prepared. In the car on the way home, I had to press the button just to see, and it actually blinks. And it looks real, okay? And we aren't gonna take it out of the box because we figure we can use this to donate to our um, toy drive around Christmas time. And if it's in a box, we can actually donate it. So hopefully we're not gonna scare some kids. Okay, so just watch how creepy this is, okay? Ready? Like, are you kidding me? That is so creepy. Okay, but it says tell them a secret. You're really creepy. I don't think that's a secret, Jess. So it cries, it sleeps, and it laughs. But why is it only doing one thing? Does it have multiple sensors all over it? Oh, maybe the ears? I just don't like this at all. It's so creepy. It has physical safety requirements. Why, is it gonna attack you? It's gonna attack you while you sleep. It's a one-trick pony, but it's creepy every time. You suck. Okay, let's move on to the next one, but we found another blinking item, which is crazy. Everything blinks, and I guess whatever blinks scares me, so. All right, so Jesse said it? that uh, I had to get an item as well. We saw this earlier. I'm not even in frame. <laughs> We saw this earlier. What I thought this was originally was one that like you could like maybe control around or maybe like runs around at streaming too big. This is apparently like a, a shoulder wrap. Why is there so much tape on this? See, this almost rivals like a Barbie doll with how much tape and like safety things there are on it. Why does it need to be this intense? See, like I would get Hot Wheels and Yu-Gi-Oh cards and all you had to do was just pop one thing and you, you were golden, you were off to the races. Mouse? Kind of the grip that I give a computer mouse. I feel like the real Wednesday Adams didn't have to do any of this stuff. Strap it to me, Jess. I'm just getting hugged. Okay, 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 I'll do it properly. No, you won't. I got this. <laughs> give it to me. One design flaw. They should have expected a near 30 year old man to wear this. It don't fit. Okay, what does Barely. it do? <laughs> to make it 
Uh, no, there, there's a there's a little button here wrapped in like 17 more safety ties. I'm I'm sensing another design flaw. It doesn't fit on my fat wrist. Strap it to me, Jess. One's all we need. This is like the struggle with my belt every single morning. You look like Inspector Gadget. <laughs> Probably needs to put batteries in this. No! It said they were included. <laughs> Give us a moment. All right, we figured out the issue. There was an on switch on this. <laughs> I'm like the coolest kid in the schoolyard right now. Barely moves. <laughs> it, it, it sounds like it's struggling. I think we need to put it to a boat. What's creepier, a blinking teddy bear or this? I feel like this one's on its last, well, <laughs> fingers in this case, not last legs. <laughs> All right, guys, um, let us know which one wins. I feel like I have an idea. <laughs> I might be stuck in this. We're gonna get going. We're gonna unbox the disturbing, inappropriate kids toy on um, our members. We've already said that, but reminder. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you want us to do a 2025 edition in three months, give this video a thumbs up and let us know. And thank you so much to all of our members. We appreciate your support. You guys are awesome. And I hope everyone has an awesome rest of their day. Bye.